So today I want to go over the possibility of raids coming to Diablo 4. And there's a few pieces of the puzzle that I think could indicate this being a possibility and first off being a question that Joe Shelley got asked in one of his most recent interviews. The question being, are there going to be clan specific activities in the future like organizing a clan world boss raid? And his answer is more features for clans are planned post launch. There's currently no organized structure to fight world bosses with multiple groups, but Joe Shelley added that it's a cool idea. And there's actually two interesting parts of this because clan specific content or systems could be very easily integrated into raids if they would be released. And the second part being Joe Shelley, the director of the game, thinks that being able to organize groups for a raid would be a cool idea. Now, usually for most developer teams, this would just kind of be a throwaway answer that people think wouldn't lead into anything. But if you follow the development of Diablo 4, they have changed almost every major system based around the community's feedback because for the past handful of years we've been getting quarterly updates about Diablo 4 explaining most of the major systems and that's actually where a lot of the information from my videos has come from. Now over that period we have seen most of these major systems either be completely overhauled or heavily modified because of the comments of the community. Skill trees have been completely redone, itemization has been completely redone, even the rarity of gear pieces has been completely rebuilt so most of the game has legitimately been built upon the opinions of the community and I would fully expect these ideas and opinions from the community to be taken into account pretty heavily with further development of the game. And the game director even acknowledging something like this could potentially get the ball rolling for bigger groups to be able to do raid style content, which right now in Diablo 4 is only the raid bosses, but you're still able to do these with 12 people. So that would mean combining three normal groups of players into that raid. And past these comments from the developers, there have been so many people in the community talking about raids since the open beta. There's been dozens of posts on Reddit with a bunch of them getting hundreds of comments specifically specifically talking about potential raids being added into the game and what people would like to see if we got a system like raids. I'm sure there's been tons of forum posts and Twitter comments and stuff like that talking about this same type of system. And I think the reason being is just that this is a very good fit for the game they're making in Diablo 4. It is a shared world game. It already has the multiplayer elements where we can have 12 people fighting with each other against a raid boss that even in the open beta we're Worked very smooth. And then we also have the possibility of people creating builds specifically to help out other players, similar to how zero DPS builds worked in Diablo 3. You just have different abilities and skills that are focused around giving your allies different buffs. So you could even have pseudo supports in these raids. You also have taunts from things like the barbarians. So you could be a pseudo tank. So you don't need a full holy trinity, but you have the options in all the different classes to have a less defined roles that could work really well in a raid because if you look at something like lost ark that's much more of an mmo they have this same type of system they don't have a full holy trinity system but they have classes that are more supports classes that are a bit more tanky and then classes that are a bit more pure dps and then you also have something like destiny 2 that has i think some of the best raids in the industry that's also a shared world like diablo 4 that also doesn't have a holy trinity system but does still have have some form of supports and tanks that help make their raids more interesting. And I do think that Diablo 4 is actually taking a lot more cues from Destiny 2 than a lot of people realize, but that's another topic for another video. And whether or not they create this raid grouping system, there's still many ways you could go about creating raids for Diablo 4. For instance, in Destiny 2, you don't actually have raid groups. You just have your two fire teams and you really don't have the UI of MMOs or other group based RPGs where you have a big raid window with all of your players in them. So you don't necessarily need that to have a well-crafted raid that works well for your groups and in Destiny 2 the raid sizes are six so you could have something similar in Diablo 4 most likely if they were going to do raids at a smaller player count they would probably be eight because that would just be doubling their normal group sizes that would make a bit more sense and then they could even go up above that to pretty much any player count they want so they could potentially even go up to 12 players which is how many we already have fighting a world boss they could even go above that 
go up to like 20 players or something if they really want to get crazy with it most likely their server infrastructure and foundation of the game would still allow for this especially if you'd be in a more instance dungeon type scenario most likely be easier to do than out in the open world and i think any one of these options would fulfill that feeling of a raid and diablo 4 is obviously being made by blizzard which makes world of warcraft which has one of the best raid teams in the entirety of the industry they make some of the best and most expansive raids in any game including all mmos and historically the world of warcraft and diablo team have actually taken a lot of systems and ideas directly from each other transmog between the games are pretty similar world of warcraft has taken a bunch of cues from diablo for some of their itemization systems or gearing systems and these two teams have definitely collaborated on some of these implementations so they could potentially be taking ideas from world of warcraft rating to try to implement it into diablo 4 and i think this also gives a little bit higher of a possibility of this actually being a reality and one of the biggest complaints or worries from the community about a raid system being added into diablo 4 is adding in content that is not going to be soloable into the game i think there's a few ways they could go about this first off they could just not care i personally would not care at all if there's things you have to go group for if they added raids and a raid system i think that absolutely goes along with a shared world game there usually are things that you have to group for to be able to do and even then the world bosses in the game right now are most likely not going to be able to be soloed in most situations maybe some super crazy end game build will be able to solo one of these world bosses but 99.9 percent .9 of the time you're still going to be doing them with other players in the area now you don't have to group with those players but you could also essentially do for raids you could just have like a queuing system where you queue up it groups you with other players but it would still basically be the same thing as just being with other players fighting this world boss there's not going to be much different between being grouped automatically with people or just walking into an instanced area against a world boss and the instance grouping you with people it's very much a similar thing and with Diablo 4 having seasons every three months and having expansions down the road being a very fast paced live service game, I would be very surprised if they don't implement some type of raid or larger player count activity just because they're going to be going through so many systems, so many ideas, so many new pieces of content that they will most likely want to try this out. And even some of the comments from other developers going through all the different interviews that have recently been held, some of the answers definitely point to them wanting to go a little bit more towards that MMO type of gameplay and that would usually point to bigger group sizes more grouped activities which also helps to create a bigger sense of community seeing all these players running around or grouping with players to do much harder activities and I would personally love raids to be added into Diablo 4 whichever way they would end up going about it like I mentioned there's so many ways you could go about adding in these raids because this just gives a much harder activity to chase into the end game and could potentially give you a reason to actually group with other players to do this much harder activity it also opens up the possibility of so many new builds being created just for raids like there are so many support type builds you could try you could try tank barbarians you could try different builds that just give all of your group tons of different buffs there's just so many different opportunities within build creation if you add in these large group activities but that's all i want to go over so thanks for watching